The Midwest is no stranger to tornadoes. There's a big difference between tornado watches and tornado warnings and knowing what they could what they mean could be life saving. The storm team's Chris Piper explains what you need to know. You likely don't need to experience a tornado to know they can be scary, but you may find comfort in understanding the differences between watches and warnings. First, we'll start with the watch. When this is issued, you need to be weather aware. This does not mean a tornado has been spotted. It does mean everywhere in the watch area has conditions that are favorable for tornado development. If a watch is issued, be prepared to take action, stay inside, and if you're outdoors, try to get inside. Of course, after that is a tornado warning. This is only issued when a tornado has been seen. A storm spotter can see the tornado or it can be indicated by rotation on a radar. We do not have to have a watch before a warning simply because a tornado can pop up instantly with the right conditions. If a warning is put out into our area, we are in an emergency. This is the time to take action. Tornadoes are powerful storms. And depending on if the storm is an EF1 or an EF5, you can see wind speeds anywhere from 85 to 200 miles an hour. If you haven't prepared yet, Severe Weather Preparedness Week is next week in Indiana. This is always a good time to make sure you and your family are ready, especially as we move into the spring and summer seasons. Back to you. Storm Team 10 will continue to prepare you for severe weather. Houston First at 5 will be right back.